you can create a website which keeps a track of all of these and you know with this you will also get help and a lot of students like us will also get help whenever we have live projects right that is a brilliant brilliant thing for our resume so why not create a website where you know we can have all this Hi everyone, this is Shruti and in today's video, we're going to talk about five web development ideas which are going to boost not just your skills, but your resume as well. So when we talk about uh, web development projects, so the first question is why exactly are we doing the projects? Why exactly are we making the projects? So mainly whenever we work on a project, you know, we always get to apply whatever knowledge we have of that particular framework or language. Be it any project, let's say um, in HTML, right, whatever tag you're learning, you learned a tag, but then it's important to implement it and check how exactly it is working. Of course, there's one more thing that uh, whenever we create a project, you will realize that there are a lot of bugs that will come. So whenever there are bugs that come with each and every bug, you know, you get better. You get better at that particular thing. So be it web development, Android or whatever other project you're creating, be it an ML. So there will be bugs, right? And while you're debugging, you will search for the bug, why exactly that bug is coming or what is the, you know, next step that you're going to take. So with all of that, while you're doing it, you will uh, realize that you are now understanding that particular concept much better and you will be able to you know further in future you will be able to guide someone else as well and your uh, hold on that particular thing will be better so that is why uh, we are creating projects and of course your skill will be developed and uh, then of course you in your resume also you can write down that project that yes you have done that project and um, that will show that you know the particular framework Let's quickly get started now uh, and talk about the five uh, web development projects. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go from number fifth to number one, uh, which according to me uh, is uh, I have given the rating. So uh, these are my thoughts, what you can create and, you know, master uh, in that particular thing as well, in that particular framework as well, and also put it in your resume because there are as you, uh, there are projects, you know, like, for example, creating an e-commerce website or um, you know making a clone of Amazon or Facebook so with all of these what exactly happens is it is good of course you learn a lot of uh, stuff while making these projects but a lot of people are already creating the, these projects and what exactly happens is uh, that while you are creating this project and put it in your resume then um, the the interviewer will all would have already seen that project in a lot of resumes so that particular thing doesn't really uh, work well right so these projects you can put in your uh, i mean you can learn you can make but putting in your resume i don't think is a good option so that's a big no no from my side but uh, yeah so let's talk about the fifth uh, the project that comes in my list number 5 okay so the project at number five is uh, in a website uh, to manage events for your college. Why I'm saying this is because, you know, whenever we are creating projects, there should be one particular motivation of why are we creating that project and what are we creating, right? So when we talk about why and we create something for our college only, for the college students, of course, when, I, when we are creating something for our college or our organization, it will be something that will benefit the organization as well. And you will be able to show that, yes, I've made this for my organization and it is online, right? So like, Let's say uh, there are hackathons organized in your college. So uh, make one uh, like even management, right? So it could be anything, be it cultural fest or anything else. There, uh, you know, people can register uh, and all of that can happen. So I think this is a really nice uh, website that you can create and, uh, you know, you can take it forward. So um, with this, you know, what exactly will happen is if your website is good enough, and your college hosts it and I mean basically if it is hosted you can also host it online and it is live and then you put it in your resume 
it will be like a big big boost whenever we have live projects right that is a brilliant brilliant thing for our resume and a uh, boost our resume so much that the you know interviewer also can see that yes the person has actually created the project so this was the one at number 5 in my list uh, for number 4 i have another project which again is uh, good for us as computer science uh, engineers or i could say the ones learning coding be it from any stream again so that is uh, we often forget you know or which um, contest is live right now on code chef or code forces or anything like competitive programming contest or uh, be it other um, let's say on hacker earth uh, any Uh, any particular company is organizing something so what you can do is you can create a website which keeps a track of all of these and you know with this you will also get help and a lot of students like us will also get help so um you know you can help people out with this so this again is one a uh, website idea that i thought is um really nice which if possible uh, please create and help other students out right so this was the one on number 4 now uh the project uh on my list at number 3 is uh, to make an online code editor so of course there are a lot of code editors online but sometimes we realize that it is not as good as others and there are different uh code editors that give different results for some questions uh, so now um, you must have seen these questions on instagram etc right all those questions which give which have different answers at, in different code editors so create one code editor which follows the basic principle of programming and uh, you know programming languages and also this uh, you know you can create an editor uh, so that you know it can also change uh, the code from one language to another we do have some uh, you know some editors like that which do the same thing but they are not as accurate right so if you are able to create an accurate uh, code editor which can change from one language to the other which can change the code from one language to the other let's say a code written in c++ to java i think that should be a brilliant brilliant thing so uh, this again is a uh, project idea that i think you can create and again it will help you as well as other students so why not do something for yourself and the society while creating the project and learning the skills right so it's time for uh, the project at number 2 in my list and that would be a portfolio so as a web developer you must must have a uh, various uh, projects and why not create a uh, an online portfolio like a website for demonstrating those projects and you know showing your skills so i think that is something uh, which you can do so yeah the second one would be a portfolio which i think can i mean you all as a web developer should have so uh, the first one now it's time for the uh, project uh, which uh, is at number 1 in my list and that is uh, an app for uh, games now when i say games it's mainly the uh, card games right so while we are playing cards i mean uh, recently while i was playing cards with my uh, friends i realized that it's not that always you know while we are playing teen patti and all of those cards right so uh, card games i realized we don't always have uh, you know uh, the points or we need to make uh, paper notes and all of that so while we are doing that i mean is there is no app i think or a website where we can you know uh, just go ahead and write our player names and you know we can bid and then we can say okay this much is for this this much is for this whatever we do in team party and all of those games right so why not create a website where you know we can have all this and uh, at the end uh, it can calculate how much uh, has been uh, there has been won by one particular player and who is the final winner and uh, i'm not saying that it should also have transaction from our real bank accounts not that but probably we could have uh, you know some coins some uh, virtual coins which we can give uh, to each player as we do in the starting right we have equal amount of money that we uh, bid and everything so we can have that and then uh, each and every player could uh, you know just 
click on that particular thing uh, in the website and at the end we could have a scorecard and then of course later on however the uh, you know players can players want to give money or not i mean that is up to them of course but then i think this is one project which i don't think is there and if you create it it's a brilliant thing so and then you can host it and i'm sure a lot of people will uh, use it including me so yeah i think that was uh, that was a list um the five uh, projects that i think you can create uh yeah thank you so much bye